Okay. Uh, what is your name? Uh, I'm uh, Joseph Tio. I'm a electrical engineer. Your experience? Uh, my experience, I'm a consultant from the U.S. Embassy. And other U.S. Embassy, you are a consultant regarding electrical? Regarding electromechanical project. Project. Okay. What uh, you can say about this uh, test demo about electric, Ismail electric car? Well, uh, it's amazing uh, discovery. And uh, it's a... Uh, and uh, unbelievable and it's been technology from Ismail. Uh, based from the 12 volts battery at 200 watts, this one, it's okay, you can... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's only, you're only using uh, 200 amperes? No, 200, 200, 200 watts. Uh, 200 watts, uh, I mean. And the uh, load? Uh, 12 volts and the load is uh, 15 kilowatts or uh, 15 horsepower. So, uh, I think, uh, to run at 12 volts, that's impossible actually. But by uh, new technology, this is what we call it PWM or pulse width modulation, this is what's happening. But now you are sure that there is no extra connection or external wire under the chassis? No, 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 no magic. No magic, truly really, there is no outside wire, etc. Yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, okay, maybe you, uh, engineer. <laughs> The, okay, okay, we can go. Based from the uh, existing? Uh, based from what I saw, uh, it's really amazing because uh, without fuel, it's under the car. Because usually, the car needs fuel para, um, to get out. But in this case, the smell car, there are no jumper wire for the car. Outside, there is no external. Pero na power niya yung, ano, yung DC motor at mm, 200 watts tapos yung ano yung... Uh, watts battery? 200 watts battery? Watts battery tapos yung DC motor na 15 horsepower. 15 horsepower? That's so, impossible, ano? Impossible siya pero with this new technology, okay naman siya. Ah, okay. So, Improve pa naman yun eh. Okay, how about Leo? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes. Uh, yeah. Your, your name, please. Yes. I'm Leo Paras. Uh, I'm an SAL specialist for oil and gas. Uh, we usually deal with a uh, big horsepower uh, drive system. Uh, the way we look at it, I have evaluated uh, Ismail's uh, drive system. I call it the drive system rather than the whole thing because uh, what drives uh, the car is the drive system that run the motor. Okay. Yes. Okay. So basically, we have uh, we have uh, achieved something here in the sense that uh, we use only a basic uh, 27 AH battery, very Ordinary. small, comparing to what we have known in the past that you need a, a bank of batteries to run a certain uh, load in this kind of inverter uh, design, uh, Ismail uh, controller uh, drive controllers. Uh, uh, besides, besides uh, another thing, although there's only 200 watt we are using battery, but still we are uh, discharging manually to avoid overcharging because... I, I think there is a future on this design because, uh, as you see, with limited uh, power source we have, we can extend uh, the light, we can extend or regenerate the power within. So, with few basic design and modification, I believe, this thing is a uh, near future or uh, could be the thing of the future uh, in the coming days. How about the scaling up, like running not, this is 15 horsepower, let's say 500,000 horsepower, like running a ship or a big truck or etc. Uh, uh, what that, is the scalability? Is that's, the, that's the way I can see in the design because uh, right away, if you compare the power outage against the input power that we, we, we have been using, it's relatively small. The way I look at it, if we further uh, improve the design and everything, the chances we uh, the load can carry uh, the load can carry the given power output uh, of the design. So it means it's positive that it's the scalability to increase the horsepower or just changing the motor and increase everything here. To scale up, it means it can uh, work more well, thousand times. Not to say that uh, out of small power you can get uh, great power. That is not even, uh, well, to some designers, it is really questionable uh, to, to have an available power of, say, a thousand watts that could give a ten thousand watts outage. So, uh, 
the way I look at it, my evaluation is this is very promising because every inch of power that you have on the battery is being utilized and regenerated. Very good. Okay. Now, at this time, what we can promise, after 15 days or 20 days, this will perform a ro actual road test. Though, so we will know exactly what will happen. Now, it's just a show of some interest. We don't know exact figure, but there is something amazing on this technology. And now here on this side, we are uh, preparing now the enclosure. Uh, enclosure of this car for, you know, protection from the rain, etc. while at road test. Maybe in 15 days, this can be possible to perform an actual demo on the road. Okay, thank you.